amateur mixed martial arts rules in the featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he enters the cage with a mixed martial arts record of two losses. He represents MSA. Please welcome David Adams. His opponent standing across the cage, fighting out of the red corner, making his in cage debut, representing Apex MMA. Please welcome Alistair Fitzharris. Your referee and challenge the action, Mr. Dean Weir. While well, Brad, we get ready to close the cage door and start this third fight here at FCC 21. David Adams fighting in the blue corner in the red West Coast Pitbull trunks, taking on Alistair Fitzharris from the red corner in the red Pitbull trunks, who's initiated the takedown straight away. And I would advise those watching to keep an eye out for the blue and red tape on the gloves. Absolutely. Uh, if you're looking for an easy way to tear them apart, Fitzharris uh, is the, uh, the bold competitor, whereas David Adams has the full head of hair. Just took a big head kick, yeah, he's... smiled it off. Adams really needs to keep those hands up in these exchanges, Steve. Yeah, he fights out of uh, Gracie Barr, and maybe, maybe he's hoping for the fight to get to the floor. He's going to have to if he keeps oh! his hands. But a left hook there, shooting from the hip oh. Adams. But the response from Fitz Harris was even, even nicer. As he's working a body lock now. Looking to tie up the head of Fitz Harris is David Adams. Adams breaks away though, and Seven. there's an issue with the glove there. Oh, it's back, it's back, and I believe the finger had slipped out, but. And referee Dean Weir's going to call time here to get this glove sorted out. Checks it, it's good, and we're back underway. Straight away Adams with a jumping technique of, and the... Th there's no technique there. He really is just throwing caution to the wind, Steve. And taking a lot of shots because he's, of it. He, he's he, not enjoying this at all, Steve. He keeps turning his back away, but he, he, and then reaching for his opponent. He's, and maybe, just maybe, this is where he wants this fight. Maybe well, not. You've got to think he does because on, on the feet he has absolutely nothing for Fitz Harris. But let's see what he can do here off his back. Straight away he's got a he's got a more active guard than perhaps. But yeah, if this were a contest that allowed knees to the head, or if Fitz Harris was, was a serious power puncher, this one would be over by now, perhaps two or three times. Yeah, absolutely. And let's see what David Adams can do from this bottom position. Uh, look, look for the trip there. Didn't get it. And now he finds himself back on his feet and uh, having to deal with, with the taller ranger and frankly better striker again. Yeah, and, and it is. Oh, yeah, that referee's going to be looking to step in. and Referee Dean Weir taking a good close look at this one, Steve. It's Fitz Harris, reigns down punishment. Adam's yeah, only, a, only just enough though. Only a few of them are getting through. I mean, I've got to give David Adams credit. He's. he's Bucking and twisting on the bottom, and some of those shots aren't getting in, but it really is one way traffic at the moment for Fitz Harris. I want to see less of these crazy jumping, spinning techniques from Adams and just a straight one two shoot for the double leg. If that's what you're trying to do, get the fight on the ground, or just jump into guard. Try, try and pull the man's head down into guard. He's going to get caught badly off one of these shots if he doesn't change oh, it he, up. He didn't like that one. That one got through and he didn't like it. Now he's covering up and he's tapped out the strikes. Has to be said, Steve, uh, an, an almost inevitable outcome there based on how that first round was going. Yeah, absolutely. Just, you know, it reminded me of MMA way, way, way back in the day when you'd get a practitioner of jiu-jitsu against a and it just seemed on his feet. He didn't, just didn't have the tools to deal with this opponent. Yeah, that was some uh, UFC one hoist Gracie level striking <laughs> from, uh, from David Adams there. Certainly that's what he's gonna have to go away and work on if he's gonna come back here on FCC. But all credit to Alistair Fitzharris. He saw the openings, he made best use of them. Ladies and gentlemen, at a time of two minutes,
appreciation, please, for his opponent, David Adams. <laughs> 